hey, I just wanted to make this real quick to help you learn what a serial entrepreneur is. So a serial entrepreneur is someone who starts multiple businesses at the same time. They always have a new idea going. Their brains run like machines. They always have something they want to do, want to complete, and they are focused and they are always inviting challenges into their life. They live for the challenge, they live for the thrill, they live for the chase, and this is it. We're gonna break it down. Okay, so here we go. They start one business after another. So you're like, all right, you start a business, you're working on it, and then you just, boom, start another, boom, start another. You're jumping business to business to create a whole network of businesses. And if you're really good, they'll all be complementary to each other, and then you'll really achieve even better heights, even more heights and heights after that. Okay, so other than that, you have, and then you'll just get it, you either sell the business and move on, or you'll put someone in place who's very competent, so you need to hire the best people if you're gonna be doing this, put them in place, and then make sure they're doing a great job, and then move on to the next, because you live for the thrill of starting it up. The challenge is always in the beginning, so the beginnings are the most difficult times. If you start, you're still challenged in the beginning. That's where there's so much struggle because you don't know what's going on you don't know what's going on so it requires a lot of learning so if you really like learning this is the place for you because you will absolutely crush it okay you'll do amazing if you're just looking for the thrill looking to do a great job and tell me how this new format is let me know what the new format is like for you i want to know also you're pursuing new ideas constantly you're just ready like i got a new idea i'm going to pursue this and just take my mind put it on it and say I'm not going to let any of that other stuff get in my way. Keep trying new things and innovation. So, okay. Taking initiative. So you're just going to be taking initiative. You're just starting. You're just like, all right, let me just start. I don't need to wait for anybody. I'm just going to start doing what I'm going to do. And then they'll follow up. They'll catch up to me eventually. And that's a great way to be because you always be ahead of the curve. You'll be in the front of innovation, the forefront of technology if you do this, which is the place you want to be. And also market share. So, okay, you jump on opportunities quick. So when you see a new opportunity arising, you don't give it that much time. If you think about taking initiative is you'll jump on that opportunity super quick. You'll say, all right, here's the opportunity. Let me jump on it. And then you'll really crush it because you see that opportunity. You're like, you're on it quick. You don't let time pass by too quickly. And also, you can create a firm structure. So you create a firm, solid structure that anyone can take over, but really you want the best in there because the best equals the best. Quality makes more quality. Quantity does not. So you want to always go for the best over quality. But you can always have a lot of people that are quality, which is also really going to help them along. Okay. You live for the challenge. You live for the chase. You want to go in there. You want to learn what is the problem in the industry. You want to go in there, crack it open, figure out all the answers and then start building the structure out of there. You're not just waiting. You don't like spending a lot of time waiting in anticipation, thinking, how is this going to happen? You say, all right, I'm going to run in there. I'm going to take the action and I'm going to see what I can do from there. I'm not going to wait too long. I'm just going to go in, see what I can do and crush it because you're a serial entrepreneur. Entrepreneurs start businesses. You start a lot of businesses. You just love the thrill of it. You kind of get a dopamine spike from it, like getting high from starting businesses. It's pretty great that way because you can provide a lot of value, a lot of service to people. Just don't get too carried away where the structures start falling. If you can do that successfully, that might be the best way to be an entrepreneur because you're always expanding, you're always making new markets, you're just giving more jobs, creating the economy boost that we all need and we all want. So, thank you and Please like if you liked it, subscribe, and let me know what you want to see next, what you think of the new format, and as always, peace.